Hi, I'm Farhad Salda, working as an application engineer at Alde Company. Today at DAC 2019, I'm demonstrating a demo uh, for 4K Ultra HD imaging using optical flow. Uh, in this demo, as you see here, motion is detected and uh, using optical flow. So different direction comes with different colors. For this demo, we are using Tyson 3 board which has the ZU7 EV chip on it. This board is provided by Xilinx. It's under the Zinc MPSOC family. There are many different peripherals on the board, like uh, QSFB Ethernet. There are four USB 3.0 and two Ethernet connectors as well display port and HDMI port in and out. So what you see here is the 4K uh, Leopard camera. We are connecting it to the board through the FMC connector. And we collect the uh, 4K image, imaging to the FPGA side and we do the processing for motion detection inside the FPGA. We accelerate it inside the FPGA and we demonstrate this 4K demo and then uh, 4K display. One of the main usage of this uh, demo would be, uh, for example, for engineers who are gonna start developing 4K based applications using FPGAs. <laughs> this will help them to start their application uh, very fast and then we provide all the files, all the uh, the, the references I'm coming with this has all the hardware and software that they need to start the application and develop upon that. And uh, by using this compact board and getting the, the power of ZU7 EV, they can develop uh, ADS applications or like uh, video processing applications uh, much easier. For example, we have another application where we collect the imaging or the videos and send it through the QSFB connector to another Tyson board and show it on the screen. So this could be like an uh, example for a 4K video conferencing. And this, the output of this demo is 60 frames per second. It's very fast as you see on the monitor. So the output of this demo, as you see, we get up to 60 frames per second. It's very fast and agile and uh, the, the, also 4K. These are the features that we can get out of the, uh, when, when we are using FPGA. And this is one of the main reasons of using FPGAs. Thank you for watching my demonstration. And please go to our website at www.aldec.com and let us know what you think. Thank you.